Hi again, Survivor. I'm Rainer, 26 years old, and I'm living here in sunny San Francisco. I'm a Stanford graduate, entrepreneur, and fashion designer. And I am here today to tell you exactly why I am going to be the next Survivor. I'm going to tell you the four reasons why I know I've got what it takes to win this game. First reason. With an engine like this, do I look like the most athletic person who's ever played the game of Survivor? Hell no! And that's what I want them to think. It's because I'm a natural chameleon, baby. I am a master of disguise. Truth is, any of those people out there, they're gonna have no idea what hit them. Because I am the most deceptively physical person to ever play this game. Fact. Numero dos. After working in fashion for the past five years, I've put up with over the top angry women, whiny gay men. I know what it's like to be the minority. You think that stopped me? Absolutely not. At work, I'm the hub that turns the wheel. Everyone thinks they're in charge, but at the end of the day, they're all taking a ride aboard the rain train. Choo choo! Number three. Look at these eyebrows. These are some bad mamma jamma, stomp them in the throat, kick them in the balls kind of eyebrows. I'm a high octane powerhouse. But when I want to be, I can be as likable as a cat, as nice as a butterfly, as sweet as pie. It's six foot, 220, with a hairy back and a bald head. There's absolutely no reason a C-minus like myself should be getting any kind of attractive girl. Despite all of that, I scored an A-plus hottie. You think that's because of my amazing good looks? Absolutely not. Just because I'm proud to be in the no hair, don't care club doesn't mean that's why she fell for me. She fell for me because I'm incredibly friendly and fun to be around. You think she's the only one that's fallen for me? Of course you do, but I'm here to tell you that at heart, I'm stone cold. I grew up an army brat, moving every couple years. That shit's tough. Little kids are mean. But did I let that bother me? Did I whimper home to mommy? Sure as hell didn't. That's because I've never cried a day in my entire life. At the end of the day, I had them wrapped around my finger. They even voted me class president. I've lived with hippies. I've meditated with the Dalai Lama, and I have even done Bikram yoga. And I will do whatever it takes to make people like me by putting a smile on this face. After graduating from Stanford, I did what every straight guy who studies finance does. I got a job in the fashion industry. But after four plus years of that, I had to break away. That's because I'm a 26 year old Tommy Bahama and cubicles are not my cup of tea. So I decided to create the most radical men's short shorts company in the world, Chubbies. Walking around, slinging shorts, all I wanted to do was let people know that thighs are the new guns. Skies out, thighs out, baby. Of course I'll be wearing these puppies on the island. These are the ultimate deserted island shorts. You've also got to be incredibly manly to wear these shorts. You have to have the testosterone of a raging bull. I will be absolutely shitting on the competition in these things. Strutting around, bulging, dropping slaughters. The money shot! Is it just my imagination or do the people who play this game not know what's going on? I'm the most intense person you've ever seen on this game. I'm the smartest person you've ever seen on this game, and I'm here to win. What does it take to win Survivor? Huh, easy question for me. Deception, intelligence, boldness, likability. I've already shown you I've got all that. What matters most, what matters more than any of it, is intensity. And there's no one that can beat me in that. Not one person out there I've ever seen play this game has half of what I've got, and I'm here to win.